Hi everyone, so I just want to do a quick update video, but before I get started, I want to show you a quick snippet of Honey Bunny because she's pregnant now, so her belly's really, really big, and so she keeps rolling over on her belly every time I come outside so I can give her like a little scratch on her tum tum, but she can't get up when she rolls over, it's just really, really cute. <laughs> Alright, so back on track. I have actually finished all my school assignments now and I'm so, so happy because I passed every subject and I'm just thrilled and I can't wait because in at the end of this week on Friday, I graduate, so I finished grade 12 and then I've got schoolies the next week and I've got my formal this Saturday as well. So I'm really excited for all that and I just want to get a few videos up before I do go away. If you guys want, I'll try and film when I do get ready for the formal and I've got my dress and everything and it's beautiful. Um, if you do want to know any preparations for formals and stuff like that, I've actually written a bunch of stuff on my blog which I'll link in the bar below. But anyway, I just want to share a quick story with you guys about what happened to me today. So I was going around to town, it's about 20 minutes away from where I live, and I was hanging in this resume for this job because I want a kind of a casual job over Christmas holiday so I'm not just bumming around at home doing nothing all the time so I handed that in got a little mocha frappe and it was good it was it was actually very very good I ha um so after that I just like oh yeah I'll drive home now so I was driving because I'm on my L plates and I've got about 15 hours before I'm on my P plates woohoo so I was driving in my car, mum's next to me, it's just us in the car. So about two minutes into the drive, I feel this thing against my leg. Like, you know when a random stray hair just like blows in the wind and it tickles your leg and you're like, oh, there's a hair blowing it and it just like, it kind of irritates it. But I felt that, I'm like, oh, and then it starts moving. I'm like, hang on, hair doesn't have legs. So this, I feel this thing going up my leg very, very slowly, like just creeping. And I'm wearing a dress, I'm like, oh, there's something on my leg. So like, I quickly glance down. And all I see is this big black thing about that, okay, about that big, and it's just like crawling up my leg. I'm like, mom, 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 because she's right next to me. I'm like, mom, this side of my leg, this side of my leg, and I start freaking out. And I'm on the main road driving, and so I start freaking. Out. I'm like, mom, this side of my leg, I don't know what to do. And we're going to like a green light, and I'm like stopping like this because I'm like, this side of my leg, and it was just scaring me so much. Mom, mom, what's wrong with you? Mom's like, don't crash, just just drive. We'll find a place to pull in, and you can get it off. I'm like, this side of my leg, and I can feel it just go like higher and higher. I'm like, I'm wearing a skirt. This perverted thing's gonna go up my skirt. So I was really freaking out. I finally found this random driveway on the main road. So I quickly turn in there and then I just jump out the car and this massive cockroach about that big, it's black as anything and it's got these stripes across it and these massive antennas which just make it like 20 times more deadlier. And this thing was on my leg. I'm just like, screaming and I'm like doing this little, you know when you do the bug dance when you're like, ah, and you're like the same dance you do when you run into a cobble, be like, eh, try to brush it off. So I got it off and it crawled underneath my seat before I could squish it. So I'm like, oh, there's this cockroach living in my car under my seat. So I'm like, mum, you're driving home. I'm not going near that seat. So mum had to drive home and the whole time home, I'm like, mum, mum, what if it's still there? What if it crawls on me again? And like, so I was kind of like, I was actually shaking, I was on the verge of tears when this thing was crawling up my leg. Anyway, so I got home, and mum walks in the door before me, and she gets, and so I'm like in the doorway, and mum's talking to me, and she goes, turns around, and she's like, oh yeah, there's a spider next to you, just casually says it like it's no big deal, I turn around, that, that far away from my face, there's a spider about that big on the door, and she's like, ah, and jump to the other side of the room, yeah, so that's my story of how I nearly crashed the car, because there was a bug on me. So, yeah, have you, has that ever happened to you guys? Like, have you ever been driving and this, there's like a spider anywhere near or stuff like that? Because it's just freaky and I really, really hate spiders. So, anything to do with bugs, apart from butterflies, I like butterflies, and some moths, they're kind of groovy looking, and ladybugs. But apart from them, the only good bug is a dead bug to me. So, if you guys ever had like an experience like that, then leave a comment below because I'd love to read it because I just find them very funny after they've happened. I hate going through them because... They scared me, I felt my heart going, and the adrenaline and everything like that. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys soon.